I think we had a little misunderstanding there. Without any more to do, comment, you can take it away with Little Gator Game. I hope you have a really nice run. Thank you, Super. What's up, every what's up, every Archie Thoners? Uh, I'm Comet, um, and today I'm playing Little Gator Game. This is a game about a little gator game. Joining me on commentary is going to be Frozen Flygon. Oh my goodness, I am here to Gator Walk. I'm so excited for this run. This game's really cute and has some amazing speed tag, and Comet's going to crush it. I can't wait. Yeah, so I, I'm pretty sure because the the margin was pretty wide but i've i've pre-set up pretty sure gator walk is the uh is the winner of the it final can confirm. war can confirm gator walk okay one. yes so we're gonna be gator walking through the speed run real fast so frozen if you could count me down and i'll uh, get ready to start absolutely let's get it in three two one go gators all right, so right off the bat, you're going to see the text is going out, going by really fast, and I'm hopping. Um, there's a speedrun mode in this game that just matches text for you, so I'm hands-free right now. Um, and we're going to see uh, we're going to see our name pop-ups pretty soon. Um, starting off the like with the story of this game, uh, we're little gator, and uh, we want to play with our big sis, uh, but big sis is busy with schoolwork so we can't play with big sis so we make up our own game to try and impress big sis so much that she'll stop doing her schoolwork and being a responsible human gator and will play with us with our game common little human gator you know that's how yeah. it goes right now we're actually playing the game and we're and so we have uh we have some things we need to get since we're uh, since we're a little gator off to go on an adventure, there's some tools that we need. We need a shield, we need a sword, and we need a glider. And we are going to be getting the shield first. This is probably the most important of all the items in little gator game because you can shield surf, which is a very unique mechanic only in this game. It is so, so fast. And it's when busted. you surf, when you surf on the shield as well, and you jump, you can just continue to keep your momentum. You y'all are gonna already start. You're gonna see that. it right here. Right here. <laughs> so you got this little race, and you're just gonna see Common just flies through it. The the shield also, you know, we can see this movement up this wall. Common is making it look a lot easier than it is, but you have to really have precise aim to get up these walls. And this is not necessarily the way they want you to go. No, this is a uh, not the usual way up the mountain, which is. So the next item we're getting is gonna oh dice. Oh no! No, no you <laughs> Um, okay. This actually I've never fell in here. I think you could have gone the normal way instead of falling all the way back no, down. No, no, you can't. You need to spend money that way, and we're not spending oh, money. Oh, I see. I see. It's I fine see. because I'm a gamer and got back. No, 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 no. <laughs> you're you're very good at this part. I'm not worried. There we go. Yeah, so this is a little jump we gotta do, which is kinda hard. There you it's, go. It's pretty much a blind jump through the trees. Because, yeah. again, you're not really... I mean, it's pretty straight on, but you can get destroyed by tree collision, so... Now we're up here, we're going to be getting the glider. Avery! And in order to get the glider, we talk to Avery, and we get this cool hat that looks very unique. And then we get a glider, which... It looks kind of familiar, not going to lie, it's but I don't know... It's a little familiar. What, I don't know what it might be from, so... I also, think Avery just... has an exclamation mark after their name, which is very important. Yeah, Avery... You spell Avery... A V E R Y, uh, no capital A, and add an exclamation point at the yeah. end. Very important. So yeah, now we, now that we've gotten the sword, and now we talk to our sister, and we're gonna be like, "Yo, look at all this cool swag I got. You want to come play with us?" And she's like, "Nah." <laughs> she's so now just we're simply sad, not impressed. And Avery cartwheels away into the ocean. <laughs> Bye, Avery. I love you. So now we're sad, but then Tom starts texting us. What's up, Tom? Yo. Uh, Tom Hello? has this huge game that he's coming up with. Also, this is, I forgot that guy's name. Uh, gives us a bracelet, which allows us to have stamina. Now we can climb. Yeah, so if you get off the island without having purchased a bracelet, the game will still give you one, which is really nice. So. Yeah, it gives you for free. That's what I meant by we don't want to spend money. Yeah, we don't, we don't want to have to purchase it. That guy usually charges you. And money in this game is when you destroy any of the, like, little paper things. Basically, money is just, like, the pieces of paper. Yeah, this so... one of our favorite friends. Yeah, this, this is the whale. 
The whale is very uh, friend-shaped, but also useful because it shoots you up into the air. You can shield surf, you can glide. So we're going to go back to the whale a few different times during the run. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so the whole purpose of this game now is we're trying to find as many friends as we can um, to play our game with us too, so we can impress some big sis and so she'll stop being a responsible gator and play with us. Um, and so here we have our first group. Um, we have the science team. And so we get three quests from them. We have to find a Hercules beetle. We need to find the yellow triangle and find a beach ore. Yeah. Um, and we're pretty much going to be like multitasking this one. We're doing it all at once. For right now, we're trying to... There's, these blue guys have a rare drop chance of dropping the rare yellow triangle. So we're going to be breaking those to try and get that. And then, but we're going to take a little detour over here to go to the picnic tiles because they, they can't decide what food that they want, but they tell us what type of food they want. And so we then make the decision for them. Yeah, we help them out. And that's really efficient because that gives us three friends. So yeah. it's like, no, we need certain friend milestones. So any quest that gives us multiple friends at a time or friends are near each other. And dang, you're getting really unlucky with this drop. Okay, finally. Yeah, finally last got... one. Ugh. Pretty All right, and, there. and yeah. luckily I'm uh, I'm doing very well on scraps right now. You see that 532? I need 500 of those as of yeah, like in about five seconds. Um, but here's the Hercules beetle. And now we're going to get our first item over here. It costs 500 scraps. It's the shuriken. Yeah. And now I'm just going to have this prompt to press Q to use the item on for like a minute because I'm not using it. Sorry. I think that's an Archithon reference. Shuriken. Yeah, probably, right? Yeah, pretty amazing. Yeah, now we're just chasing the Hercules beetle because it's flying away. But first, we're going to say hi to Pot Kid. Hi, Pot Kid! Break his pot. Pretty sure the triangles always drop by the last blue guy. Squeal? Uh, it was Squeal, a bit. Squeal, you're... Yeah, you're... <laughs> I don't know how to tell you this, but it was a bit. All right, so now we got the, the, the Hercules beetle, and now we bring our beach ore, and now we got to hit it a lot because... This is part of our quest to forge the ultimate, the ultimate weapon of our adventurer gator here. Do you feel the fire of creation igniting in your heart? Do you, you feel, feel the earth's power surging through your bones? I do. I definitely do. It's a paleolithic tool. Yes. And now, finally, we bring the uh, yellow square or yellow, <laughs> yellow triangle. So the whole point of this quest was uh, to get more friends. But all these kids were doing science stuff, and that's boring. Um, so we try to we try to ruin their science experiments. But all we did was make them have even more fun with their science experiments. So <laughs> bad news, I guess. Unfortunately, um, but they decided to become our so friends anyway. Science. This is so sad. Yeah, they're still our friends anyway. We have this little this cat trying to have a tea party with her mom, but her mom's on the phone. So we go tell her mom to get off the phone and have a tea party, and so she does. It's very cute. Now we're heading over to the next main quest. There's three main quests in this game. We just finished the first one. But first we gotta save this guy from the from the cardboard plants. Robin. Goodbye, Robin. Hi Robin. It's really cute. The general, like, overall, the adults are playing along with all the kids, and the kids are just really into the game, and it's I it's really sweet. This game's adorable. All right, for this next quest, we have the cool kids. We have the science team and yes! the cool kids. And they're, they're having fun at the water park, but they had the water off. So we do decide to do them a favor and turn the water fountain on. But then they get mad at me for turning on the water fountain and turn it back off. Cool. And they, they turn off all the pumps in the park. Cool, Comet. I can't believe you're interrupting their vibe. I know, right? Here's Joe. Joe's going to do a cool pose to make friends. This is some of the most cool routing in the run right here honestly um you're gonna see chess soon right? yeah the chessboard's coming up you guys donated for the chessboard first we're gonna gonna throw some shurikens at that chessboard to make tony mad and then we are going to fastest chess win of all time we just we're gonna put on that he's like why didn't i think of that we usually don't put on the chessboard but you guys paid for it so we're chess time now Chess. yo fluffy bull moment we won't see him. Actually, no, I'll, I'll show you. There he is. Let's go! <laughs> I usually don't look at him because it requires moving <laughs> the camera, but... Here we have our first pump that Lucas is guarding. And then all I have to do is... Spam my enter key to skip the dialogue because it doesn't matter what you pick. That dialogue is very important, though, because it is extremely adorable and gay. 
so. Yeah, that's true. It's very cute. Oh, also, I want to on... watch Power Fighters on DVD, comment. Yeah, I, I do want to watch Power Fighters on DVD. Thank also, you. I didn't explain our bubblegum item. Yeah, the bubblegum's sick. Uh, I pretty much... It uses stamina, but it lets you fly. Also, now oh. we're playing Ace Attorney, but Gators. Yeah, Wide Truth Doubt is the is the way to go. And then you win. You turn on the pump. So we've activated Lucas's and Duke's pump. And now here's that... We picked up teeth earlier. It belongs to Becca the shark. She lost her teeth. And now here's the last pump. Who is being guarded by Jada. And so we need to first touch some grass. <laughs> get some clippings. I'm glad we're touching grass at the end of this marathon. This is very important. And then we get a bucket. Because we need... We're trying to plant a tree here. So we gotta fill it up with water. And then we bring it back down. We... We... We got... Then we destroy billboards. If you try and destroy that before you've gone through this quest, it doesn't work. No, it's indestructible <laughs> until the quest so line. Also, we get a big leaf here as a new as a new shield, but you guys, once again, you guys donated. We so, need chests. Chests only. Chest time. Thank you. So yeah, you can see that with the chest surfing, with the bubble gum, we have a lot of, you know, speed tech up our arsenal here, which is very, very helpful. Yeah, lots of movement to do. But yeah, now we, uh, we've convinced everybody to turn on the pump, and now the water Yay! fountain is is working. And Joe's here doing their cool pose. Yeah. And so that's the uh, the second of the of the main three quests. And we're now up to 26 friends. That's a lot of friends. Now we're going to talk to Madeline from a game that I don't know about. <gasps> Madeline's so um, nice. And this is a really sick jump I'm about to do here. I'm going to skateboard on this guy. Get up onto this mountain. Nice. And just go straight up yeah, to this part, which is where the right third. Yeah, this side quest. That's great. Where the third quest is. That jump is so awesome. That was really. That was an awesome jump. Can I just jump in for a blurb just for a second? Yes, you can. Okay, I just want to remind everybody real quick that we still have an incentive open for the next run in less than ten minutes for Will You Snail to choose which hat you're gonna have on the snail. So right now it's a snail hat on a snail. Number one. But number two is a top hat, and you can also choose a poop hat or a Santa hat. So make sure you get your donations in for that fast. And just a quick reminder, we're raising money for trans rights. So if you think trans rights are cool, make sure to get your donations in at exclamation mark donate. And this is a really sick run. Keep it up, comment. I'm team Thank Santa you. hat. I'm all, I'm all in on that. I didn't have much time to explain this quest, but uh, but right here we're, this is, we're, we this became an empire. <laughs> I wasn't ready for that dialogue there. <laughs> Esme is incredible. No, that uh, part's so good. Actually, it, it, maybe it's maybe it's best that I don't explain that because you just can just play the game. You need to play the game to talk to Esme because she's amazing. And we're gonna jump on the whale again. We're gonna go over here this time, and we're gonna talk to Andromeda, who's a space nerd. Um, and this part's this is so hard for me. I, my aim is so bad. I gotta throw my shuriken that I bought earlier at all these aliens. Yeah, the theater troupe basically has all different ideas yeah. for what they want their, like, thing to be. And so, this character is obsessed with space, and so you get a little, you know, rocket shooter. It's, it's very cute. And now we have a lightsaber. Yeah, I mean, well, I'm not gonna use it, but... <laughs> no, but it's there, you know, it's there if we want. I just menued super well there. Alright, there we go. Putting the, the, putting <laughs> the, the bubble gum back on. This game is actually quite It's difficult. impossible. It's now really... here we have Twig, and Twig wants <gasps> Hi, Twig. me to do a front flip. So wow, 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 good flip. flip. Wow, wow, wow. And now we're friends, because oh. that's... What friends I wish do, I could they come friends with people by just doing the flip. Now we have our, our third friend here. This is Velma. We gotta catch the cow kids. I'm... This is going great already. Um, sometimes you can just get really destroyed by cycles with the cow kids yes. and they like run all over the place. But uh, that was... Despite, that was, I that was like, a, feel like a decent cycle. I had to chase the first one, but that was fine other, otherwise. Now over here, we're gonna destroy only the fake pots because we have a, my aim's so good. We have this guy here who's afraid of pots. Banner. Thanks, Tanner. And yeah, now now the, we've we finished, uh, we've we rounded up all the, uh, the characters from the quest, so we're just gonna jump back up the mountain to finish this quest. We got everybody together, and they're gonna form a restaurant up here on the top of the mountain. As you can see with the food It's so sign. cute. The restaurant's adorable. 
All right, now we're gonna do a big jump again. Big jump! Oh, this jump's so good. Yeah. All the way back to the playground. This is what we where we find out what we were using our friends for. Usually you'd find this out at the start, but because we 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 don't have to do that at first. We're, we need friends to so that we can exploit their labor, so that we can they can help build our castle, our at the playground. As you can see, the there's all these. So cute. There's like, all these signs works here. together to make it look just so styling. To make sure our sister has to come and hang out with us. Yeah, it's gonna be so sick. She's definitely gonna want to come and, and play the games with us. So yeah, we lose five friends there. We've exploited five like, five friend labor. And now we've exploited ten more. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. like, we're just a around. good manager. Yeah, we're just no, we're just a good manager. Profits are through the roof right now. We can do anything except to run around the entire game, skate on a chessboard, and throw shurikens at people. Now we're gonna so. show big sis. <gasps> Yay! And she doesn't want to play with us. Yeah, she's just still too busy with like life and college and stuff. Now it's time for flashbacks. I'm gonna time be for honest. The emotional flashback sequence, you know. I'm every, gonna every be real right now for a second. I do not remember why this part happens. <laughs> basically, you're remembering like um. Well, like yeah, you're remembering the DMing along sister. the way, basically, and so you're understanding her perspective. I mean, yeah, yeah, I think you're right. I think you're right about that. Here's a cool jump that I didn't know about. Oh, that's a such a good shortcut. You can just go up that way instead that's of taking awesome. the usual path. <laughs> the routing of this game really took off right when the game came out, um, but it's still a lot of cool developments. I'm um, just climbing the mountains. As we do here at Archithon, you, you know? Do. Or as you don't do. That's what this marathon's not <laughs> Yeah, we're almost at the end. Time's coming up after I get down to the bottom of this hill and I break the cardboard. Well, there's a lot of cardboard, but the one at the bottom. Mm -hmm. This one. And time. That's a 16-10 little gator game. Nice job. That was pretty clean. So yeah, and then at this point, we are able to finally convince Big Sis to come play with us. But yeah, that's little that's little gator game. That was that was the entire game. Well, there's more <laughs> game, but you know, you should you gotta play it to find out. Yeah, there's a category called all friends. Uh, basically, if you do that casually, you get to meet everyone, and it's it's super wholesome. I really enjoyed this game. If you liked games like A Short Hike, uh, it gave me very similar vibes mm -hmm, yeah. to that. I highly recommend it. Yes, um, this game, like, honestly, it's just worth it for the dialogue. The dialogue's so funny. <laughs> it's great. The characters like we skip, are fantastic. We skip through all of it, but it's so funny. So you gotta, you gotta play a little gator game. I forgot how much it is, but it's pretty cheap, and it's pretty short. You can buy it now. And also donate to Archithan. Yes, exactly. That's a perfect segue. This was an amazing run. I really liked the art style, the vibe, the story. Super cute. Thank you, Common Flying. Do you have any last shout outs you want to give? Um, I'm probably not going to be streaming this game, so if you want to watch this game, then I, you're not going to find it from me. But if you like Celeste, you can follow me on Twitch. Um, okay. Also, you should donate. I said it already, but I'm saying it again. You definitely should. I cannot disagree with that. And uh, with that, thank you very much for your run, both of you, and um, hope you have a very nice festival for your Archery Thon.